Eve Online and Major Freak. Uh, this is just a quick one. I uh, chatting with a war target and uh, joking about, uh, you know, where my Astro houses were, were. And of course, I'll declassify this once the war is over and I've successfully unanchored my. Uh, my Astra house on the other side of Genesis Losek, I'm sure he knows about it anyways, but... Yeah, regardless, uh, I was curious if I could, uh... I swear I can remote on Anchor. I think I remember it, like, decommission, right? Pretty sure you can just, you know, decommission it. Where is it, where is it, where is it, there it is. Yeah, pretty sure you can just right-click and go, decommission. Yeah, see? Yeah cancel it see bloop and of course you can you know uh, uh, cancel the commission just like that bloop yeah thought I could yeah I mean that way um, you don't have to travel to the system and locate agents or alts watching you can go oh he's in system and then they go and check the up well and sure enough you can see it's an anchoring and they can pretty much guesstimate when you started anchoring but if you don't enter the system at all and they're not watching it 24 7 you can just when you know they're sleeping just go and they'll never really know exactly when and as long as you can get in there and with a you know just trundle over with a freighter um you know when you know they're sleeping because you've unanchored it when they're sleeping or, or started the de decommission process it should be a piece of cake really honestly as long as you don't loiter around there see what i learned in low sec when we would steal player owned towers like the POS stuff all the time I mean to me it's like oh something's doing something out of the ordinary and you just go wander over and check it out and sure enough something's anchoring or unanchoring or something or something stupid they're they're trying to be sneaky but just act normal don't go there till you absolutely need to and if you do need to do it when somebody's watching set up a pattern that it's normal thing for you to do and nothing untoward is going on and then you just do it while that's going on just just act normal just make it a pattern like if you want to do something out of the ordinary start making it ordinary that you're doing this and then all of a sudden people are like who cares and they don't notice what you're doing but yeah but it always happened in Lozette. people would just do something out of the ordinary and you're like oh that's interesting and you go over and check it out curiosity kill the cat and sure enough something's somebody's doing something stupid <laughs> which was pretty much the case for a high care bears trying to go in a low sec it was pretty funny but yeah anyways blah 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 oh yeah i s i was talking to war target too i was just stupid that the whole timer is so long but the armor timer is like two days it's like guys you just it should be the opposite you should give so much time for you know you get the shields gone you get armor timer so you've got what less than 48 hours to get to get the word out by changing the name and, and telling people hey you know blah, my they actually attack my structure you better get your clones out but yeah 44 clones rip right there and that's i think that's my highest count others have like two to three dozen tops a couple couple have one dozen but still you know hopefully those aren't yeah hopefully uh yeah hopefully i'm sure there's one or two billions of isk worth of implants that are just now going to get destroyed but i tried my best to send out the emails to uh, people who'd activated clones the last five months was it September, October, November, December, January. Yeah, five months. Yeah, and I'd had it for two years. So, God, it must feel for the people. But, like, my clone base really only started getting popular a month before 
domain research mining what as as lines wonderful huh <laughs> I know just perfect timing isn't it <laughs> oh well it's oh, what can you do right <laughs>